Okay. Oh, I just don't give a pug. <laughs> it's a pug. Oh, it's a pug at the top. <laughs> Hello. Um, it's me, Mariam. Uh, we're going to Inverness with Mina. Yay, Mina. You may know Mina from many videos where we eat things. <laughs> and also where we go on trips, I think. So Mina and I have never been on holiday together in the whole 20, 30 something years of our friendship. Yeah. So this is our first ever holiday. Um, and I'm just... so excited because I'm away from my kids. <laughs> yes, no children allowed. So um, also like we are vaccinated and all of those things. None of us have COVID, so we're good. But Everything is very plans. safe. <laughs> That's true. Don't talk about my lack of man. So <laughs> we're going to go to Gatwick now and we will see you there. See, this is the London I love. It looks like the Eye of Sauron. Yes. Do you remember when the fox lived at the top? When they were making it, oh, the fox... it made its home yeah, there. Yeah, I do wonder what happened to that fox. They probably killed it. I like. We've just re left, I think, Red Hill. Yes. So we're not far Next away up now. Is we're in Surrey. Surrey. So we're so hungry. <laughs> we are very hungry. We were foolish to not pack food. We had a, yeah. I had a nectarine, didn't I? Yeah. I managed to split that in half. But, um, yes. What I could do with like a McDonald's. Oh, four hash browns. Oof. So we're hoping Gatwick has fast food yeah, or and something. not just a not, prep. Yeah. Or giraffe or something yeah. stupid. And if it had Nando's, I wouldn't mind Nando's. I could eat chicken right now. Yeah. <laughs> but we're going to have about two hours till yes, our flight. Exactly. So we're almost there. I'm showing Mina how to use the cameras because she gets to have one yes. and I get to have one. I'm so going to make some funny videos. We'll they may actually good time. need to be beeped out and that's okay. Put as explicit. <laughs> my, my family, well, only my family. Watch my will YouTube. Be shocked. <laughs> we'll see you at Gatwick. Bye. We are at Gatwick. Ah, we just got to Gatwick. Oh, all checked in. Oh. <laughs> I am trying to film. Here is Birdie leading the way. And this is all fun and games. I've never been to Gatwick before. Me, yes, yes I am. I shall end it here because we're going to go look for food. Mina has found the Harry Potter shop. <laughs> How much do you love Harry Potter, Mina? Too much. <laughs> I have a husband and three children and I love Harry Potter more. What house would you be in? What house? You know what? Everyone wants to say Gryffindor, but I think a part of me might be Slytherin. <laughs> no, I think I would be in Slytherin. <laughs> or I'm going to go for Ravenclaw. Ravenclaw. Oh, Layla would like that. <laughs> All the Harry Potter things, there's chocolates and... Hmm. Fudge flies. I'll spend all my money before we get into Scotland. <laughs> We're complaining because there are no fast food options no. at Stupid Gatwick anymore. But there's also Wee Heathrow. They just don't have them. I so wanted... <laughs> I wanted hash browns. Yeah? Nothing. <laughs> Very disappointing. I wanted Shake Shack's cheese fries, but Shake Shack is closed. So we are settling for this place. Sonoma. So we will review it. We're both having the veggie breakfast. Yes. Because Which is more than the normal breakfast <laughs> and bacon and sausages. <laughs> I am not, I'm most displeased. Then we have to get snacks for the plane because it's two hours. And um, we will there's mostly just clothes shops. Yeah. And designer like, makeup and yeah. like, does this face look like it wears designer makeup? <laughs> no. But anyway, we get our gate in an hour, so we're going to eat. We can order online, Mina. We should just do that. I like cheese. Those are good eggs. Very good eggs. I think that's beans in that tiny cup. I need lots of salt on my yeah, tomatoes. Yeah, no, I do too. I need lots of salt on everything. I want you to tip out the cup. Is it beans? Yes. A teeny tiny cup of beans. No, they're going to stay in there. Yeah. So that's Mina's. I've got the same. 
But I also, we also have a side of potatoes coming. I'm going to see what the cheese tastes like. Havarti cheese. Is it good? Mm. Oh, it tastes like your feet. Yes. <laughs> Oh, that's nice. Those are well roasted tomatoes. They're actually. perfect, aren't they? And eggy eggs. Those what? eggs are good. Yeah, the thing I'm least excited about on this plate is the avocado. I want to save all that toast to dip in that egg. Yeah. Anyway. So, here we have this Havarti cheese, avocado, eggs, beans, mushrooms, tomato, sourdough toast, and some butter. And then these potatoes, which look really good. How is it mean? Not so good. <laughs> so there we go. Breakfast. Good. To have a seat quickly, please keep the aisle clean to allow other passengers to board. If you set in an emergency exit, please to the front row. You must wait all your bags and loose items in the overhead locker. Please place your own bags in the lockers <laughs> and close them once they are full. Usable exit may be behind you. Emergency lighting Brace, will guide you to an exit. In an emergency, leave all baggage on board. Don't Your leave seat me. belt is fastened, adjusted, and released as shown. It must be fastened when the seat. We're at the airport. We have to technically get to Inverness now. Um, she's gonna be a challenge. Let me see. Press the red button. I gave Nina a camera. I think that might be our bus coming. Um, we're waiting for a bus. There's ready.
now so I'm following Birdie she says that she does the directions because I'm all for at directions and I feel there she is there's my leader my tour guide Hello. <laughs> and here we are it's quite nice it's very old I like that and um, I think we know where we're going Terminus food. This is so we know where to get our snacks. So this is where I'll be coming. My cherries and strawberries. And Mariam's taking us down some dodgy looking alleyway. Okay, I'm gonna stop filming now. Look at that ahead of us. It looks further away on this screen, but it's a lovely, lovely big green but it's bigger than a hill and this seems to be the high street which is very nice up there looks lovely i'm gonna do around see that that's lovely it's not i feel like i'm at the seaside like i'm near the coast all oh, cafe near it and buy one get one drink free with your bank holiday monday deals well, I have the kidney bob, but not yet. Let's get to the hotel. Here we are. This is so beautiful. Look over there. It's lovely. So we're going to cross here. Still following Birdie. It's very nice here. I like it very much. Oh, it's gorgeous here when the weather's lovely. It is me. It is me. Just let you all know that I'm still here. Amateur filmmaker. You're doing well, Nina. I'm doing all right. First, I'm looking into the camera. I'm going to go one, two, three. There we go. Isn't it beautiful? Look at the Do water. you like it, it's Birdie? It's very nice here. You can breathe. You can't really oh, breathe look. in London. Oh, look. You know that's clean water because you can see all the stones. You, you can see everything to the bottom. Yeah. There are some ducks too. Yep. I've got them. All right, we're going to walk down there. Down there. Huzzah. So here is our room. At the Avalon, yes, has has Mina sitting on the bed. It's a very nice bed. Is it comfy, Mina? It is. So, look, it has parting things on it and little sheepy pillows. Sheepy pillows and like a very nice piece of art. We don't, I mean, our view is okay. We have a cemetery outside and a kind of hill. Um, there's this very nice comfy chair that I've been sitting on. It is very comfy. Do I have to do mine? I haven't done it yet, the oh. scanning thing. I couldn't figure it out. And then we have some glasses and a guide to Inverness and Loch Ness. We have two chocolates here. I shall eat them. <laughs> um, and over here, we have a tea making station and some cookies and some mugs. And she put some fresh milk in the fridge. So the fridge is down here. I'm going to have to be sharp. Oh, and it's in a milk bottle, which is really cool. And then we have some drawers here. In England, they don't put Bibles in drawers. What's here? Oh, yes, Ooh. they do. Do they? In my spa break, I, I think a Bible. This Shall says, sleep well. It says, some heavy sleepers, others are light. It's a personal thing. But the Oh, it's earplugs. So what do we have to do? Scan this? Yeah, I, feel like I tried it in my NHS app and it didn't work. So know. here is the bathroom, which is really nice. I have used it, so. <laughs> So here is a mirror with some lights. They're not very bright. That's good, because in the night time, that would be good. A toilet and a shower. I am going to take my shoes off. My mum is going to be like, why are you wearing your shoes, Marion? So I pull the, this is a very nice shower. And then there's, oh, sea kelp, shampoo and shower gel, which is cool. Seasons come and go, but friendships last forever. Oh, Mina. Seasons come and go, but friendships last forever. That's your fishy smell. 
So yeah, it's a very nice room. It's very right, cute. I've checked in, I've done mine. Just okay. put your camera oh. on that. Just oh, okay. Check in. Were you so, trying to do that? Yeah. <laughs> All right, so now I'm going to check into the thing and we're going to maybe book a place for dinner today. Yeah, well, should we do something like, I'm not fussed, but we're not going to get into that place. No, no, no. It's closed. Shall we? It's easy. It's, um, There's other places we can have seafood here. Let's look up. So we're going to look up some stuff now um, because we've just got, she let us check in early as well, which was nice. Um, so the flight was good. We sat next to a weird kid. But apart from that, it was good. We drew a really cool, scary thing, which I will put in a picture maybe over here. And yeah, so see you a bit later. Reception area of our guest house. Val and Paul. We, we met Val. She was very, very nice. Lovely lady. Lovely, lovely person. Very welcoming. And it's a beautiful house. There's yeah. a little teddy door stop down here. And I'm loving all the artwork. And it's just very pretty. So we're gonna go walk around maybe try and find some food um because we yeah today is just a day where we are in Inverness and, and then tomorrow the and Wednesday we oh, will go out into oh look <laughs> you don't know what that is <laughs> yellow santa came yeah there's a cemetery like and a place. hill oh. um, should we go look at the Ness Islands yes we're down this Let way. Let us venture so, to Ness Island. We shall venture to Ness Island now. What, what, what? We shall see you there. What's there you go. Bye bye. Here we are. Coming to the. These are called the islands, aren't they? The Ness Islands. Ness Islands. There's a house hidden over there. The guy's fishing. It's so lovely as Birdie. And we found some fellow people. We're going to walk over the bridge. And he's thrown his fishing rod thing. Oh, 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 <laughs> Lovely. Oh, so beautiful here. Further down. Right, I'm still going to film while I'm walking yeah. over the bridge. Oh, do you know, part of me just wants to jump into this water. Walk no, through I, it. Oh no, I would die. Marion would. Can I take a picture of you on the bridge or not? Yes. <laughs> Just for you. So these are the Ness Islands, which are uh, Airbnb hosts talked us about. Do you walk this way? We should have looked up some history about the Ness Islands. Well, why didn't you? <laughs> That's my tour guide. You have the phone with the battery. I would look it up now if I... Do you want me to? No, I can voice over some history. Can we make it up? <laughs> the Ness Islands <laughs> was <Consistent> where... <laughs> six islands. <laughs> Each one belonging to a lady Each of the manor. Individual check-ins and check-out <laughs> These islands were originally used <laughs> to house prisoners of war. Really? No. Oh. <laughs> no, because you had your... She had her phone out <laughs> while she said it. I was That's really why. Up. There are a collection of natural islands that sit in the middle of the River Ness, connected from the riverbanks. Now get this pretty walk we're going on to go to a viewing point. Birdie is actually taking a picture. The man is still in the water fishing. It's fly fishing, I think that's called. And the trees are, subhanAllah, so beautiful. So we shall go forward and continue with <laughs> our walk. So, the Ness Islands are a collection of natural islands that sit in the mi middle of River Ness, connected from the riverbanks and throughout by beautiful Victorian footbridges. Just a short stroll away from the Inverness city centre, it is a place of natural beauty to take a breath, get some exercise or just watch the world go by. And it really is. It is very nice. You can walk from one 
end of the island to another, entering on one side of the river and exiting on the other, winding your way round the paths and through imposing tall pines and mature trees. Mariam, you are correct, they were pines. You will find carved bench sculptures to sit on. Make sure you hunt down the fallen tree Nessie sculpture. It's perfect for a fun photo opportunity. Watch the river flow past. It really is fast flowing after heavy rainfall. And watch the fishermen in the water during the summer months catching salmon. <gasps> Mariam here was catching salmon. See? Oh, it's just beautiful. Look at that just perfect oh and the houses up there the views they've got the water, is so the water is so clean and clear look because it's running water isn't yeah. it so you could just wade in this why is like no one thing. wading in the water because you'll probably get swept away no not here look how still it is yeah. over here is where it's got a bit faster oh it's putting in my favour um, and then when they come to take the money, I'll just... There's Nina taking a selfie. See, it's so cool. The river nest. Here's our oh, pine trees. Ancient pine trees. They're so huge. We dance around them, birdie. Look how wide, well, they're not as wide as the redwoods, but they're huge at the bottom. But then they go so far up. Like my legs. Yes. <laughs> they do look scaly like your legs do. <laughs> My auntie says that ancient pine forests have very healing properties. Probably do. And I, there's so much as humans we've probably forgotten about nature and how yeah. to connect with it. You know, like to a farm where there was just no reception. Yeah. <laughs> and then you couldn't use your phone anyway. But we can. We need to reset like our our clocks. I read this book. They're so high strung. And in the book, it's all about the ancient forests. Mm. So, if you look at England and Scotland now, with all yeah. the, like the green fields and stuff, it is beautiful. Yeah. But we it's meant to be a rainforest. Yes, we would have had more because we have the weather for it, the rain. And these trees, I mean, I don't even know how. There still but, be hundreds and hundreds. But of all they, there used to be trees on the planet that were thousands of years yeah. old, and they chopped them all down. Yeah. For farmland for and farmland. wood, and you those trees have such an effect on the air and the yeah. soil that new trees even if you replant millions of new trees they won't make, it won't they won't do the same thing no no i totally agree there now when i went on my road trip by myself in america yeah. i planned it through the countryside so through national parks and oh. state parks and staying on farms because i wanted to get out of the city completely yeah and so now when I go on holiday, that's all I want to do. Look, this is a pine. So we are continuing on our journey. So we've come from that end and the river is now to the right of me, flowing fast there, you can hear it. Got a lovely tall pine tree here. Look how tall that is, mashallah. And we're just following the path round and it's gonna open up there in front. Um, it's it's quite cool now it's lovely but that's because we're in the shade there's quite a few people walking around but we're not wearing our face masks because it's not packed no, it's not we're in the look at it it's just so beautiful mashallah everything is just subhanallah it's so nice and me and murray were saying the air is so different is it's, I don't think I would have asthma, it's yeah. fresh clean it's just weird it's really hard to explain yeah. but when you're breathing in it feels different. You feel good. Yeah. You know? like it's like for, it's like you've good. got clean oxygen. Yeah. And that's what it is. It's clean air. Clean and it's air. lovely. When I was in the...
So we've come up to another footbridge here. So this is how you connect so yourself to the islands. To Glen Way. This is very nice. So it is. it's very picturesque. We like it very much. And there's the river. Look, it's so, subhanAllah, it's just, and it's so clean. I'm pretty sure further down where it's shallow, you could just walk in there. Yeah, it's so It's so lovely. Hello. It just opens up. It's just, see, look, these pine trees. SubhanAllah, it's so tall. And just love it. It's like a motorway of river. Birdie is behind me. Say hello. hello. I love yeah, we do. We've been we've been touching all the moss on the trees. We're trying to find it. We're trying to find the fallen down tree that looks like the Loch Ness. Whenever I go to Boris, I think of Overstory. I was just telling Mina um, by Richard something. I can't remember. My auntie made me read it and it's about trees and when you read it you never see trees in the same way again like the trees were here before us trees were here before us the trees will be here after us <laughs> we need them more than they need us there's a documentary on netflix about the ground i can't remember what it's called but that is also very good you should watch that about how if we heal our soil we can reverse climate change the soil is very very important and it's dying um, but sustainable farming and sustainable planting can mean that people can still plant all the food they need but they can heal the soil which will in turn heal the earth yeah. oh my God. <laughs> look at the bark on this tree and look how much money he gave them <laughs> helped them so much and he just went, oh look at that imagine wanting to cut these trees down man just to make paper yeah or furniture furniture but we don't need to cut trees down anymore we have i've got the worst balance how will i get past this i shall bend <laughs> do, do, bend and, and snap <laughs> i'm not snapping do, 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 do. Yeah! <laughs> Do you want to have a go? <laughs> I'll fall down. <laughs> go! Mariam! <laughs> She's stuck! No? Keep going! Yay! She did it! Magnificent! We are in an opening of all these trees. SubhanAllah. Marion, we should have just bought sleeping bags and just slept here. One with nature. Oh look! Mushrooms! I mean mushrooms. Uncle Paul would know if you could eat them or not. Phone him quickly. <laughs> go birdie. Go birdie, go birdie, go birdie, go. Go birdie, go birdie, go birdie, go. You're not going. Bear shut up, wiggling. Wiggling your bottom. No, you shouldn't be walking over it. You filthy Londoner. Coming over here, polluting it. I am climbing a tree, but I haven't got very high. I'd like you to look at this tree. I mean, I can't even show you the top because I can't even see it. Um, it's just it's so big. Whoa. We have crossed another bridge. Nina is a very good YouTuber. Much mm. better than me. <laughs> and here we are. We, we didn't realize how far away we actually are from where we wish to be, but it's, okay. but it's fine. So you see where that bridge is right down there? We need to get there oh, plus yeah, further. But it's still a glorious oh, walk. Yes. So we're having uh, Jamaican food for dinner. 
Yep. <laughs> My name's Scotland. Eat Jamaican food. Yeah, but this looks so good. What is yeah. this place called? Cool Running. This is in the film, but with a K. So we're going to start with the seafood platter. Yes. I'm going to have oxtail. And Amina is go. She's deciding what she wants. Do you want? Did you want the fried chicken though? No, but I like the lamb. Um, lamb shank would be delicious. Yeah, because we're getting shank. the seafood for starter. Going for lamb shank. And then they very nicely made us cocktails with no alcohol in. Yay! Mm. Is it good? It's really nice. Mix that up. Oh, I'm gonna take it to you with your. Oh, there's like a fish cake. There's You're a mushroom. Oh, look. That's there's the like tail. a whole fish. Yeah, that's the tail. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's the whole fish. What is? It's a mackerel, I think. What is it? Mm. It's like a I love these fish cakes. You cut that in half? Yes. Mm. No way. Mina and I love seafood. So. I have a half fish cake. I'll is take that a different fish to that. I think it so, is, yeah. Isn't it? I'll take a bit of the whole fish in a minute. Yeah. Take a couple of things. Thank you. I'll take up a, a calamari. Yeah. I'm gonna eat a muscle. Mmm. Mm. It's really good. Oh. It's a really nice muscle. Mmm. Eat calamari. Ooh. Mm. Mm. Good. Ooh, oxtail and lamb rump. Lena is a rump. <laughs> I'm very excited for this. I haven't had oxtail in so long. I'm going to eat it. Bye.